Let me focus my reflection today on the last paragraph of today's gospel. It says, and I quote, The one who believes in me will do the same works that I do, and he will even do greater things than these. He will even do greater things. I love the word, we can do greater things. And you know what, my dear friends, my dear brothers and sisters, my dear parishioners, you know, the gospel for today is we celebrate the feast of St. Philip and James. It's telling me and you that we can do greater things because we are born for greater things. And believing in God, believing in Jesus, will give us the power to do greater things. The name of Jesus will give us power because He is the way, the truth, and the life. He is our satisfaction. Today, give yourself permission to live a bigger and better life. Meaning to say, we need to step into who we are meant to be. We can do greater things. Therefore, stop thinking small. Stop playing small. Because we are born for greater things. If we believe in God, we can do greater things. And he said here, if in my name you ask me for anything, I will do it because nothing is impossible with God. The name Jesus is the most powerful name. Believe in Him because as what I told you, we are men for greater things. You know what? Keep believing because if we believe, God can even use our failures. He can even use our problems. He can even use our crises and worries to make us great. God can even use our weaknesses to make us strong, to strengthen us. He can make use our defeats to make us victorious. Even though we are not perfect because of our sins, even though we are not perfect because of our limitations, God has a greater and a bigger plan for you and for me. And what is His plan? What is the bigger plan of God? To give us life eternal. Only God can give us life eternal. Because He said here, I am the way, the truth, and the life. No one can come to me except I am the way, the truth, and the life. No one comes to the Father except through me. Anything we ask in Jesus' name will come true if we believe. And finally, keep believing even if others are doubting. Never stop believing. Never give up even if the road is difficult. Even if you are undergoing challenges in our life today. Never stop believing. Believe in Jesus because if we believe in Him, good things, amazing things, wonderful things are on the way. If we believe in Him, Something amazing is about to happen because he said, I will do whatever you ask in my name. That's why in some prayers, at the end of the prayers, they always end the prayers. And I ask this in the mighty name of Jesus. Friends, if in my name you ask for me, you ask for anything, 
Jesus said, I will do it. To conclude, let me say one more time. We are meant for greater things. We can do greater things. But we need to believe in Jesus. And today, what are the things, what are your doubts that you are saying, Oh, this is impossible. Oh, I cannot be healed. Oh, we will be bankrupt. Oh, nothing will be happen. Today, Jesus is giving us his promise. And this is where I'm going to end my reflection. I will do whatever you ask in my name.